a body of mass m is hauled from the earth surface so hauled means simply pulled up with a force that is varying with height y as a factor is equal to 2 times a y minus 1 into m g vector so here there might be some confusion so just to be clear this g means g vector where a is a positive constant find the work done by this force and the change in potential energy over the first half of the ascent both work by this force and potential energy we need to find for the first half of the ascent so let's find the total ascent and from there we will know what is the half of the ascent and then we can put our required limits for the first part to get the work performed by the force and for the second part it will be simply that half height into mg that will be the body's increment of potential energy so let's find the ascent first how much it has gained the height so force because of the of the the extra force that the, this force is written as 2 ay minus 1 into mg vector so net force is of course because of gravity and this external force so fg vector plus f vector so it is mg vector plus this so we can write this as mv dv by dy because force is a function of y here so and velocity we know that initially it is zero and eventually also it is zero why because we can see here that as you increase y the force is increasing but g is downwards so the force is increasing in downwards direction so as it goes up the downward force increases so it's going to stop at some time so its initial velocity is zero because initially and why, why it will start climbing it's because when y is zero then the force initially is minus 2 mg so minus 2 mg downwards which means 2 mg upwards and that is net mg upwards so it will start from rest and eventually it will again come to rest the reason we discussed all that is because the limits of v we are going to be we are going to put from 0 to 0 and the uh, limit of y will be from 0 to h where h is the total ascent so we solve this and we get the height as 1 by a so for half ascent the height gained is of course 1 by 2a so work done by this force is f dot dy and now we have the limits of y so we just do that we'll do f dot dy put the limits of uh, y from 0 to half ascent and get our answer and of course the increment in potential energy is mg into h by 2 which is this 